throughout this video. The sun is kind of starting to go down. Excuse you. How rude. beautiful butterflies and welcome back to my channel my name is holly if you don't know me and thank you so much for checking out today's video i just wanted to hop on here because i got a very exciting package in the mail today it is the stuff that i ordered from colourpop cosmetics if you have been on my channel for a while i did a haul with them years ago when i first started this channel i will include the link to that in the description box below if you want to cringe a little bit And yeah, so I ordered some goodies because in my last declutter I got rid of a bunch of expired makeup to the point where I kind of feel like I didn't have a lot to play with for some colors and stuff like that. So I'm really excited to unbox all these goodies with you today. I'll do some swatching for you and let's get started and see what I got. I apologize if you notice the light changing at all in this video. The sun is starting to go down, so I apologize for that. But I just couldn't wait to show you guys these amazing goodies, so let's swatch them all. So I got some single eyeshadows, which I'm really excited about because I have this Z palette that is pretty empty because I emptied out all of the old shadows out of it. So it's pretty hollow and the colors that I got, I made sure I didn't have. And I'm just really excited to add these to this collection to create some really beautiful looks with. So I got five of the individuals, they were all on sale. So one of the colors that I got is called Tangerine Dream. It looks like the most beautiful, stunning, shimmery orange shade ever. I'm so excited to bathe my eyelids in this. I can't wait, so let's go ahead and give it a little swatch. Oh, it's so smooth. That is a beautiful color. So that is Tangerine Dream. It's a really beautiful shimmery orange color. I'm so excited to bathe my eyelids in that. So the next individual shadow that I got is this beautiful matte color. It's called Imperial. And I am very excited about this color. It looks so beautiful. Stunning. So this is the imperial shade it's like a kind of matte muted cranberry brown color i'm really happy with that and i'm very excited to play with that color as well okay and then the next individual shadow i got there's another matte with pearl it's called playing game it looks really really stunning it's again another kind of terracotta like color but darker a little more rich very excited these are all the colors that go well with my eye color and just my palette and i'm very excited so that is what the color looks like swatched it's a really beautiful again kind of orangey brown this color is more red and this color is more orange love them both. So this color is called I Owe You and it's like a really beautiful camel brown kind of color. I am very excited. There's it in kind of like the sunlight and the shade. Sorry the lighting is kind of all over the place right now. Oh yes, I would bathe in this color. Oh my god, it's so pretty. This is like the perfect, this is the perfect terracotta. Oh my gosh, I am obsessed with this color. Oh, I'm so excited to play with this. I'm so excited. See, this is, this is what I missed. Like, the stuff that I have in my collection, I wasn't getting, like, excited to create or anything like that. But this stuff, like, I want to create. Okay, and then the last but not least, the individual shade that I got was probably the most red plummy cranberry tone. It's called Stay Golden, which I die for the name. Stay Golden Pony Boy. Stay Gold Pony Boy. It is a beautiful, beautiful shade. I'm really happy because all of these shades are exactly what I, kind of colors that I'm looking for in shadows right now that I don't really have. 
because a lot of these kind of shades were in my Morphe 35O palette that was really expired and I needed to get rid of. You're nasty. So yeah, the Stay Golden shade, I am very happy about. It's just a really beautiful red. Sorry, I already put it back in the packaging, but it's just a really beautiful red color. And I am really, really excited about that as well. So those are all of the individual ones that I got. I'm playing with really dangerous territory because I'm swatching like reds and oranges by a white duvet. Oh my God! Okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. What's the Everybody procedure, everyone? Calm. What's the procedure? Stay calm. Wait, 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 wait. Everybody, just calm down. Okay, so I'm gonna do lips next because I'm so excited about these. So I got a luxe lipstick from ColourPop in the shade Super Bloom. It is a velvet blur lipstick and I am very excited. This packaging is so beautiful. So this is what the packaging looks like and the lipstick itself looks absolutely stunning. That color is exactly what I was hoping for. I don't have any reds anymore because all of my reds were expired. <laughs> so you nasty oh my gosh it's so velvety and beautiful and like the most perfect red ever oh my gosh i'm so excited yes. be excited about this and then i got a lippy stick in the shade i heart this it is a matte lippy stick I've used their matte lippy sticks in the past, but I didn't really get, the colors I got are not ones that flatter me at all, so I never wore them really. But this, this is a color that I can get on board with. I am very excited about this. I like it too because it's more pink toned, like a little bit more of a berry than the other lipstick that I just swatched for you, and you'll be able to see the difference really clearly especially side by side, like it's much more berry toned. And I'm very excited to have these two colors because like I said, I don't have any reds anymore. So I thought this is perfect because I can have two reds in those different undertones and just have that sta those staples and be golden. And I'm so excited. I am so swatched and so happy because I'm covered in makeup. So I also got their new leaf kit. It has their Desert Rose Pressed Powdered Blush and their Gen Zen Luxe Lip Oil. I am very excited. The packaging of this, like, come on. This is everything that I want in my life and more. This Luxe Lip Oil is gorgeous. I love the packaging of it, the flowers, the mint green. And I don't really have a really nice kind of bubblegum shade like that. So like kind of mauve bubblegum and so I'm very excited to have this in my collection now. I'll swatch this for you too. I'm using spots to swatch. You're not gonna be able to really see it because it's mostly just like a clear gloss, but it's got some shimmer in it. It's really beautiful. Actually, I can probably just put it on my lips now. We're getting real, oh. Smells amazing. I love the feeling of the applicator as well. Mm. Ooh, big fan of that. Definitely gonna wear that. And then this is their Desert Rose Pressed Blush. I realized I all of the expired blushes that I had were the pressed powder ones I have. So I only had uh, cream blushes. So I wanted to have some powder ones in my collection. And I'm so excited this color is really beautiful it's a really nice kind of dusty pink color and i'm so excited to have this in my collection because it's just gonna be perfect for my skin and then i also got another pressed blush in the shade tearing up my heart <laughs> i love their kind of innuendos they use because it's kind of spelt like the Terran. it's kind of spelled like terracotta and again this packaging i just i i live and this one kind of has some sparkles in it. And I know you're thinking, are these the exact same? But side by side, they're very different. 
one is much more orange nudie toned and one is much more pinky toned and so it's perfect because those are kind of two staples two basics that's basically what my goal is here like i didn't want to just go all out and get a bunch of randoms like i thought okay if i want to get stuff i want to get stuff that's going to be staples that i'm going to use all the time so that i can make use out of this stuff instead of just getting makeup for the sake of just getting it that's a waste of money so the next two products in here are palettes and so i'm not gonna go through and swatch all of them or else that's gonna take a very long time so what i'll do is as i'm kind of talking about the palettes and why i wanted to purchase them i'll put some screenshots of swatches from the website up on the screen just so that you guys can get a better idea of the colors and stuff because like i said the lighting is kind of changing since the sun's setting so i hope you enjoy me opening the palettes now i'm so excited i'm gonna wipe all this stuff off now because i'm getting extremely nervous having all of this on my arm Okay, so now onto the palettes. So the first palette that I got, I didn't get it for the sake of necessarily liking the packaging or anything, because I can't say I love the whole California love theme, but the colors in it were the reason why I got the palette. So the palette itself is just a really beautiful neutral palette. So I'm very excited about this. The colors in this are just... I mean, come on, they speak for themselves. They are so beautiful, and the sh tones of them are all really beautiful, neutral, and would go so well with any eye color, but with my blue eyes especially, these are just going to, oh, I'm so excited to just bathe in all of these colors. I'm very excited, okay? And I saved the best for last. This felt like a full circle moment because I've been watching Kathleen Lights for, I wanna say like, oh my God, this is gonna make me sound so old, like eight, six to eight years, I wanna say, on YouTube. That's how long I've been watching her for. And she has just always been someone I have loved watching. Her personality has always stayed the same. She's never been one of those people who kind of over the years has kind of conformed or changed to kind of the norms that sometimes you see on the platforms on social media. So it's just nice to see that she stayed true to herself, but she's still really enjoyable to watch, really funny. And yeah, so the last thing that I got was, oh, it was, oh, I'm so excited too, because again, all these things that I got, they're still staples. Like they're things I'm gonna be able to use all the time. So being able to get the Kathleen Lights So Jaded palette, I just love her so much and not only do I love her but the pricing of this palette was incredible and the colors in it are all colors that I am going to be able to create such incredible fun makeup looks with they just all make me want to sit down and play with makeup which is such a nice feeling that I haven't had in a long time and all of these tones would work so perfect on every eye color too which I really appreciate she really made it a palette where you can still have fun but it just looks beautiful on everyone so I'm so excited for this I cannot wait to play with this and yeah I am just so happy with everything that I got in this haul I am so thankful and I am going to just live and bathe in all this makeup for the foreseeable future <laughs> I'll do some clips of me kind of putting away the makeup and putting the individual pans into my Z palette as well because that's always satisfying to watch for me at least, so figured I would film it for you, so enjoy that. And I'm getting mighty tired of your traveling ways and of listening to that jackass Bray. <laughs>
I hope you beautiful butterflies enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. I really appreciate all of your support, so if you could subscribe, it would mean the world to me. I also post on Instagram a lot more frequently if you would like to check me out there as well too. I really appreciate it. I love you beautiful butterflies all so much and I will see you in the next video. Bye!